is go ahead and, and uh, jump with both feet. Jump with yeah, them. jump up. Okay, can you jump a couple of times? Jump. Mm, jump. Okay, and can you balance on one foot? Okay, and balance on the other foot and hold as long as you can. Okay, and can you jump on one foot? Okay, can you jump on the other foot? Okay. Kate's eight years old and he was diagnosed with Duchenne muscular dystrophy and basically it's just a life-threatening disorder that affects all voluntary and involuntary muscles. Um, there is no cure. Um, there's nothing available as far as treatment besides steroids. Um, Cade has been slowing down, noticeably slowing down. Um, he only walks for about 10 or 15 minutes. He gets tired very easily. Um, he's restless through the night. Um, he has he barely ever has energy to do anything really before he came here and he um, gets very frustrated very easily. Um, he's had headaches every single day for about two years since he started steroids. Um, has been constipated all the time. Um, when we got here, um, he the very first day after the very first treatment, Cade came in real sluggish, had a headache, he was dizzy. He literally ran out of the office and was ready to go for the day. Um, he went home, he went to the bathroom on his own twice, um, he slept through the whole entire night, didn't snore, was very comfortable. Um, the rest of the week we went to different museums and aquariums, he walked the whole entire time. This has not happened in months. Um, his legs are softer. He's he's excited. He's he's excited about being able to do things and being able to for me to catch up with him instead of him having to catch up with me. Um, and he's I mean he's his personality's changing. He's he's talking all day long. He's happy. He's had no headaches. Um, he you know still has a little bit of the constipation, but he's I mean he's going to the bathroom on his own without the medicine. So and and sleeping soundly soundly through the night. He's asleep in, in 10 minutes, which before it took hours to get him to fall asleep and he would still wake up a couple times during the night. Um, mobility wise, he, he's, he hasn't even complained in three days of being tired at all. So I think it's, I think it's a wonderful thing. Really How about do. his headaches? He has no headaches. Has not complained of a headache since day one of treatment. Not one headache. And he and literally has complained of a headache almost every day for two years. And how much does he normally walk? How, how long was he able to walk normally before the treatment? Before the treatment, I, I would I would give 15 minutes would probably be pushing it. Um, he, he can walk, he could have walked longer, but it was a whiny, sluggish walk where he wanted me to pick him up. And after about a half an hour, he would just sit down. I mean, if if I made him walk or I forced him to keep going, after about a half hour was his complete limit to where he would literally have to sit down or he would just sit in the middle of the floor. And yesterday, how long did he walk? Yesterday we went to the Texas State Aquarium. He walked for about two hours there. Never one time complained of being tired. Never one time asked me to pick him up or stop to take a break. He was literally running through the aquarium wanting, wanting me to catch up with him. Um, we went to a couple stores, went shopping, walked through the whole stores went home or went back to the hotel for about 10 minutes back to the hotel and he did sit down at the at the hotel but then we went to the beach and he walked the whole beach for two hours and then we went home and he still wasn't tired he played could he have done this before no. the treatment he could not have done this before the treatment no way no way kate and kate has kate has so much energy energy is a big thing with him right now he, he's never had energy ever okay now Prior to the treatment, he could not jump on one foot, is that correct? He could not jump on one foot. Okay, he could jump on two feet. He could jump on two feet, but as recorded on Monday, barely get off the ground. Right, okay. And so. he could not run. I mean, he could run, I take that back, he could run. But it was very, very slow, didn't bend the knees, and he's he's running now. It's not it's not quite fast, but it's, it's only been five days, but he's running. He's running better than he, and then he ever has. Of ever. And let's see, let's see a hop on two feet. Okay, good. And then 
uh, back up a little bit, back toward the door, and then can you hop just on one foot? Can you raise one foot up and they're okay? All right, okay. And then can you just raise one foot up and stand on one foot? And the other foot. Okay, do it right. <laughs> well, just hold your foot straight up. There you Good. Go. And then the other side. Good. Much better than Monday. Back on film with Kate again. And then I want you to run as fast as you can down to me and then as fast as you can all the way back to the other way. Okay? Come on down. And all the way back. All the way back. And then all the way back to me. <laughs> and all the way back to the door. You didn't know this was Athletics 101. Good. Super. All right. Now, one more time, I want you to jump for me. And we're going to do what we did in the other room. But I want you just to stand on one foot and hold your foot up like this. And then the other foot. And then hop. Put your feet together and hop, Kate. That's how you were going yesterday. Oh, oh man, that was much that better. Was huge, one, Katie. one more hop. One, one more big hop like that. that. Super. All right. How about one tape again. You can do it. All you right. can do it, Kate. All right. Let's see a one foot hop. <laughs> <laughs> One more one hop and we're done. Yep, they got off the ground. Got off the they ground. got off the ground with one foot. There. Hey! <laughs> All right.